The last Fulmart 8 Series mixer was built in the mid-90s. So if you're out buying a used mixer at an auction or somewhere, the newest it's going to be is 20 years old. When in reality, most of them are far older than that. So just keep that in mind when looking at them. Uh, when we sell a remanufactured mixer, you know, it's going to run and work like new again. And it's going to add a whole other service life to the machine. And that's the, that's the object here. So to make sure you get the right machine, we tear all the, all the guts out of it. And all of this, all of these shafts and gears, all the bearings and seals and everything get replaced automatically. Um, all these shafts and gears and everything get a precision inspection on the bench and any parts that aren't within specs and tolerance get replaced. The shaft is going to get replaced. The shaft is bent and it's hard to believe that you can bend something like that but 40 years of making dough can actually bend those shafts. They have to be replaced. The planetary won't rotate properly and it'll rub and it'll create further damage. Of course we strip the machine down to the, the bare chassis as you see here and sand it, paint it, grind it. We give it a good industrial grade, gray machinery paint job that's durable, acrylic, so it's easy to maintain and easy to clean. How they, if you turn the machine on and off, okay, and these are hazardous. We would upgrade the machine, and this is for safety because you can bump up against the see it won't start. You have to. That's what an oil pump is supposed to look like. These are the pieces of the oil pump that we pulled out of this machine. This machine. Um, again, this was in a store making dough. So someone could sell this to you and say, yeah, it works. Um, all day long. I had to remove the gearbox to get the main shaft out of it. But the planetary was seized on the shaft. So we had to remove the gearbox and press it out on, on an arbor press to get it out. So even in the field, if you bought this machine and you wanted to get it repaired, okay, some service guy would have to come in and do this in your store or remove it and take it to his shop, one or the other. Um, this is the, the dough hook. This is how we had to get it off the shaft. Because a lot of people never take these off and clean them. So they, they seize, they, they corrode and become one with the agitator shaft. And they have to be cut off to get it removed. Now when you're on eBay and you see a picture of a mixer with a dough hook on it, it this might be a permanent fixture. Uh, we talk about mixer voltages. You know this is the spec plate off the machine. It has the voltage of the machine and the phase. Earlier Hobart models, um, this is the H series, uh, were voltage specific you buy one, you have to make sure you get the voltage and phase that matches the elect electrical service in your building. Okay, when you're on eBay, nobody's asking you what voltage is machined, what phase do you need. They're not asking you what you're using it for, what application you're using it for. When you buy it from us, our consultants will make sure they ask you all that stuff and make sure you get the right machine for your facility and for the job you need to do. We test every machine after it's been rebuilt and to make sure that every machine runs flawlessly. When we start the batch, we start a timer and we observe the machine's behavior throughout the vixing cycle. Okay, um, We test each machine for 15 minutes, which is above and beyond what a customer mixes dough for the most part. Um, but we like to give it a little extra run in. We record all the data from the machines, all the readings, the current draws um, that they exhibited here in our shop. Uh, we keep a complete uh, bill of material and record of everything that's been done to this machine. So if you have any issues in the future, you can always call back. We can tell you what we did to it, uh, what parts were replaced. 
keep a complete detailed remanufacturing history of the machine. So this is the secret life of an old Hobart that you're never going to see in the picture on eBay. But when you buy it from us, uh, we're going to make sure that it, you're not just getting what's left of the life of someone else's machine, that you're getting a whole new life of a new machine all over again, right from the ground up.